What's up guys, it's me Zane, back here doing another Clash Royale video. Today I step into my Gaming with Zane main account, and today we have something good. And with good things comes the 2v2 practice challenge. I don't know what it is yet, but uh, you know, we're gonna see. We're gonna see what this practice challenge is, and uh, we're gonna enter our free, you know, entry fee and see what happens. Okay, let's go do this. Okay, um, so we have uh, three chances, I'm guessing. Um, and this is where you start from. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six, ten wins. Okay, um, I was about to say what. Uh, it, if it didn't add up to th the ten, I was about to say what in the heck. Um, so we're going to see what happens here. Um, so this is the 2v2 practice challenge. Um, I don't know what to expect at all so electro arena okay so um the same decks okay so i get the same deck so i get my deck that i'm dominant dominant with um that's fine with me i'm all good with it um let me go ahead and zap it go ahead and put down a tesla um so we can uh, draw that and this can go like this okay so we're gonna go ahead and put nothing down um that's not too good uh with that okay so we're gonna have to put down a graveyard so we can uh, help out that little uh stoppage um hopefully we can uh like really do the like, okay we're gonna have to reinforce this push with a knight but the electro wizard will not get the the uh full force um thing so, uh, we didn't get the, the move yet. Dang it. I can't believe I didn't get that move. Um, so, Zap coming in. Um, we do have... Uh, I don't know if I can defend that. Um, teammate, you gotta get something. Okay, gosh. We both have something bad. Uh, we both have uh, bad decks. Uh, single target decks, I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah. His deck is way different than mine. And that's what's gonna make us lose um right there so that's just gonna be the way it is uh good game um so inferno dragon i'm just gonna come out and say this inferno dragon needs another nerf um tell me if you think that the inferno dragon needs another nerf because look what just happened just look what just happened and then ask me again if it needs help okay we're gonna have to see um Okay, so basically, this is like one of those um, challenges where if you lose, you don't get a strike. You just lose and 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 lose, and lose until you get the job done. So guys, this video might be an hour. Um, honestly, it might be an hour because sometimes um, when I'm playing, I uh, do, you know, my best. I try to do my best when I do these videos. Um, so heal spell is coming in, and the heal spell will um, attract the balloon, and the balloon will be able to get at least one hit, and that'll be enough to uh, take down the whole thing. So Tesla coming in. Um, my teammate does have a distraction with the uh, um, giant skeleton, but I'm going to go ahead and put down a knight in front of that because why not and uh, because you know zane can and i think that just destroyed the whole push <laughs> it really did um i'm gonna go ahead to uh, put on zap um he can't really do anything and that's what makes 2v2 matches really hard to participate in um so come on we can do this uh all, all i gotta do is regen all my all my uh stuff but that, that'll that take forever um okay so come on um all right we don't have nothing um we're gonna have to heal no um so well played right there that's all i can say on that um because that was a good combo but we're gonna go ahead and bring in a good combo right here with um this um right there that was a little bit uh you know a little bit uh horrible i would say um, in a sense, we're going to go ahead and heal everything up and maybe get a little bit more damage um, to that king tower. Um, we do have some problems with this uh, left tower or the right tower that we have here. Um, so, knight coming in. All right. Um, 
So we might be able to do something, but the bowler is going to stop us. Um, so I'm going to stop the bowler with the Tesla. Um, and at least the elixir is rolling through like uh, like I wanted it to. Well played um, right there. So I'm pretty sure this is going to be the end of this uh, you know video. Because you know you can't you can't defend up against that. This is too much, too much, guys. It was too much, and they overcame us, and we lost. Okay, that's what the summing up of this uh, of this uh, thing is. So we're gonna go ahead and heal this up, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and zap it, and um, we're gonna go ahead and just uh, do nothing, and we're probably gonna lose um, right now. So we yeah. We're going to lose, um, but uh, we're going to take some uh, cards with us, um, and uh, that's just how it's going to be. Good game right there. So, well, good game. I think that was a pretty awesome thing with that uh, us defending our you know, king tower. I think that was pretty awesome. Um, we can defend our king tower a lot more, but uh, I don't think the deck that I'm using is the right deck. Um... For the job, I get to cycle through all my decks. Um, I have a lot of decks, guys. Um, I use all these. De okay, I can use this one. Um, maybe. Um, it might work. So I got one victory. What? One victory? That didn't make any sense. How did I get one victory? Um, I don't understand that uh, at all. Um, so I'm just going to let it go. And um, I guess we got one victory, I guess. Um, okay, so we're just going to go ahead and hopefully win some. Um, I'm hoping to win some at least. Um, so, Golem at the Bridge. It's always pretty bad when I put the Golem at the Bridge because uh, the Baby Dragon goes ahead, but it didn't this time, and that's what got my uh, intentions right there. So, I'm going to go ahead and put the Zap down, and uh, the Heal Spell will um, provide um, a lot for us in that tower um we're gonna be getting the tower i do believe no we will not be yes we will from that explosion and we're gonna go ahead and put down the baby dragon okay so i'm gonna have to put down something to defend um you don't need to put a fireball dude you just wasted that you just wasted he just wasted like four elixir so you know you didn't need to put that down man it's we're and, like, now it's going to put, uh, hello, sir, you have no Wi-Fi, apparently. Um, so, that really pisses me off when this happens. Um, now it's just frozen. Um, like, to you guys, it's probably not, but, uh, to me, it's freaking frozen. It pisses me off when this happens. Okay? Like, I'm doing a video, and somebody just pulls the string. Okay? Like, really? And then the lag catches in, and it's like, hello, should we should we let this happen? No, it's being a turd now. I don't like this. I don't like it at all. You can't play the game without uh, lag. Somebody turning off Wi-Fi, and that really pisses me off. Really, really, really pisses me off. And that's probably what's going to lose us. See, we lost because of my freaking Wi-Fi. Okay? I'm going to have to chuck... Sorry about that, guys. I'm just really agitated um, right now. I'm really mad. Um, and, um, yeah, um, I'm going to see if it's turned on. I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, guys, I'm back. And, uh, yeah, that was just a little bit. Uh, there were glitches. Nobody shut off Wi-Fi. The Wi-Fi was perfect. The Wi-Fi hasn't been shut off. So I don't know what that was. Um, a lot of lag in this video. That's all I can say. Um, I don't know. It's weird. It's really, really weird when that happens. I really do not like that. I try to hold my tongue and uh, not cuss, but sometimes, you know, guys, it just really gets to you. And uh, at least I held my tongue for that long. Pretty good. See, I held my tongue. I said, hey, not cuss. Um, because, you know, you're doing a live video and, you know, you have lag happening. Lag happens all over this network. So, okay, so this is not good. This is not a good uh, thing that's going to happen. Um, we're going to go ahead and put down some archers behind the golem. Um, and he's going to put down some barbarians. That's going to do a big number. 
of damage to him. We're going to go ahead and put down the knight. And um, we're going to go ahead and zap. No. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and zap that. And that will only get that balloon uh, one hit. So that's pretty good with that. And guys, I haven't played with a balloon in a while. So I don't know how it goes. You know, it's been so long since I played with a balloon. And uh, it's just been such a long time. Um, so we're going to go ahead and uh, just let it play through, honestly. Because I don't have enough elixir to counter anything. Um, I do have four elixir, but guys, you got to understand, this deck is way different um, than any other deck that you play with. Um, it's just way different. You know, you have to um, manage your elixir in this deck. Uh, you have to make sure that um, you have enough, you know, uh, power. Honestly, you got to make sure you have enough uh, elixir in your deck to support the deck. And um, that's basically what this deck's all about. And um, it is a big um, spender. So um, that's probably why you've seen me um, mess up a little bit in this video already. So archers. Um, knight is coming in too. So hopefully it'll get... Yes, good. It got... Okay, so... Um, we're going to go ahead and uh, heal up the um, everything there, um, but it did miss most of it, so that's not going to get everything there. So, hopefully we can take down the, wow, um, wow, I'm just going to say wow because that was pretty awesome, it's pretty great right there. So, Golem, um, I'm going to have to make a cheap, but, uh, you know... Cycle deck. I'm gonna have to make one of those. Um, my version of the cycle deck. Um, so I'm gonna try. Okay, let's do it. Okay, I'm gonna destroy one of my decks, and we're gonna make it happen. Um, so, or I can use my oldest deck in the book. Um, and not the oldest deck in the book, but uh, it's this deck. I've been using this deck for a while now. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and use that, and maybe we can uh, get another crown. I don't know. Maybe. We can get 10 crowns in this video. I don't know. We can never tell. You can never tell in this game because you have so many awesome things that you go with. And, um, you know, you have so many cool things that can happen. Um, so, let's try to uh, do something. Okay, so Mega Minion in the back. Um, just in case you guys want to follow up how to use this deck, go ahead and follow these steps. Um, we're going to go ahead and put down this, this. Um, we're going to go ahead and uh, raid everything that you see there. And we're going to go ahead and put down a zap. We're going to go ahead and put down some spear goblins. So just in case, you know, you have some problems with other uh, units, we're going to go ahead and put down some skeleton army. And uh, they're going to get delayed, so that's not going to really help out much. Um, the uh, That push over there is going to get shut down. Um, but uh, his push is going to get shut down as well, so that's okay um, with me. So, okay, so Mega Minion. Shouldn't put down the Mega Minion, but I did. And here comes the Mega Knight, and uh, the Mega Knight's going to do a lot of damage to that, and it's just going to be a lot of good work. So, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put down the uh, Rage now. Um, right there, Rage is in. Um, for everything there, and as you can see, the tower is down. Um, and, and it was just the work of a, of a raid spell in a graveyard, so it's crazy. It, it can get really, really crazy at times, guys, when I'm playing with this deck. It's very cool how the deck can move, and it's just pretty awesome. Honestly, it's pretty great. Um, so, I'm going to go ahead and put down the Mega Minion. Right now, what I'm trying to do is just stall... Um, I'm trying to use this deck in a way that I can stall, but uh, that Ice Golem is not going to get to the tower, so that's going to be okay. I'm going to go ahead and put down a Skeleton Army, and uh, we're going to go ahead and put down... Okay, so they zapped. That wasn't pretty good for me as, as at all um, right now. So we have a Mini Pekka. He's defending pretty well. Um, pretty great right there. So we're going to go ahead and put down... Um, graveyard, we're gonna go ahead and put down this, we're gonna go ahead and put down this, 
and that might do something. Um, right there with a zap, and uh, the raid spell will get a little bit of damage um, on the tower, so that's okay. We're going to go ahead and Mega Minion. We're going to go ahead and uh, Spear Goblins. The Mega Knight's going to do a lot of damage, and the Hog Rider will not get to that tower. And that's what, uh, it's awesome. So, we're going to go ahead and put this there. Hopefully we can get back around to the raid spell, and the raid spell can uh, do some good damage, but... We got it done. We got it. See? Good game uh, right there. That was actually a very great um, game. So, as you can see, I told you guys that this deck can do things. Um, and it can defend, honestly. It can defend on the ladder um, in uh, this mode. Um, but you just have to know how to play it. You just have to know how to play it, okay? Because if you don't know how to play it, then you're wrecked, um, basically. Um, so... We're going to go ahead and just place these down, and it seems that's uh, okay. So, it seems like they had a counter for that. It's okay with me. I'm all good with it. Um, so, Mega Minion is coming in. Maybe we might be able to get that job done. Skeleton Army again. They are, are enraged, so that's not too good for us right there. Two Baby Dragons coming in, and um, I'm going to go ahead and assist him with a Rage. Um, and, uh, yeah, that's not going to get too much as well, um, because, you know, the skeleton army can really damage anything that gets in its path, so you got to watch out for that. Um, so, okay, um, there's a lot of things that are going to happen. Hopefully, we can kill that wizard and get the job done. Okay, so I'm just going to start it up with my backwards push. Um, okay, so we got that. It's not too good. Um, Skeleton Army. We're going to bait it since he baited his. We're going to go ahead and just get things started, hopefully, um, with this uh, Rage. Whenever the Rage gets in. Rage coming in now. Um, and, uh, yeah, so that's not going to get too much damage on the tower. It might if we had a little bit more time on the clock but spirit goblins are gonna probably um set the tone but no they're gonna go ahead and do that so we're gonna go ahead and do this with the mega minion the knight's gonna help out as well so that's gonna do some good damage to those baby dragons and take them out as well so that's gonna do good um for us in this so we're gonna go ahead and put down skeleton army um hmm, okay so I'm going to go ahead and put down another Skeleton Army. So, a lot of Skeleton armies in the mix um, right here. So, we're going to go ahead and put down Graveyard. We're going to go ahead and put down the Rage spell. And that will just dominate. The, the, the Skeleton Army can just dominate everything, any push that you make. So, if you have Skeleton Army, you can really, really counter this deck. You can really counter this deck. It's really simple um in how to counter this deck it's very very simple so rage thank you very much you little little chicken i would say because you know good luck um but uh we're gonna get this done with the mega minion um i don't know why they're trying to rub it in because uh they just won good game you didn't get the three crowns so thank you very much dude um thank you very much um, so, okay, that was actually pretty good, so we're doing good. So, okay, so I'm kind of understanding this practice challenge. I'm understanding it, um, all the way, because basically, um, it amounts to how many crowns you get in a match. So, even if you lose, um, if you get, like, two crowns to, like, three crowns, um, or two crowns to one crown, um, then you get the you know, you get to win, you know, and that's basically what it does, it just adds on to what, um, stuff you get, so it's pretty cool, um, with that, we're gonna go ahead and put down a rage, um, right there, hopefully that rage will do a good da a lot of good damage, um, right there, we got that going in, and it's okay, I think that was a pretty good push, um, now the hunter is just gonna shut that ice, wizard down but we're gonna shut him down on our turf over here so um we're gonna go ahead and do this 
All right, so he's got that. We're going to go ahead and put down the skeleton army um, right in the nick of time. Because if that thing would have got there, it would have been too late. So Rage is coming in, and the Rage will do a lot of damage um, with that P.E.K.K.A. And the P.E.K.K.A. will take down the tower. That was actually pretty good. I was hoping for that, but I didn't know if it would work um, at all. So it's working that was good. That was good. We took down the tower with that. So, uh, well played. Uh, good luck and well played. So, that's good. Okay. Maybe we can win. I don't know. We might be able to win this. I don't know. But, uh, you know, each uh, match that we do, um, the rocket will not hit the... Yes, it will. Okay, cool. Um, that will be good. We'll just have to defend up against these, uh, this Inferno Dragon. With the, the uh, might that we have, and... Okay. Graveyard. Rage spell. And that will do the trick right there. Go ahead and put down this. And then uh, we're going to be getting the job done right there. Hopefully we can. Good game. There we go. Three crowns, and that will put us, I believe, up to seven. Because we have uh, four crowns, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I think we do have four, yeah, so three crowns it's going to send us up to, so seven. We're going to go ahead and collect this as well, and that's going to be good. We're going to go ahead and put down another quick match. Why not um, get the job done and uh, just have fun because that's what this uh, challenge is all about, 2v2 practice challenge. Hmm. I didn't think it was going to be like this. I thought it was going to be a little bit different, but uh, we're going to go ahead uh, Mega Minion. Um, this, this, and, uh, Skeleton Army is late, but, uh, it really does do the trick when you have defense, um, and you want to defend, and it really puts it out there. So, he does have a graveyard, so we're gonna have to counter that. Mega Minion's not gonna be able to do much, but, uh, we're gonna go ahead and put down the Skeleton Army. Skeleton Army. Spear Goblins. Um, I don't know what happened to me. Um, so, Mega Minion, okay, so we have a good push over there, um, well played, um, right there, uh, but we did get the tower, that actually really worked out decent, um, so we're just gonna let the elixir, um, come back up, because that's a big priority in this deck, you gotta let your elixir go up, because if you don't, then you're screwed, um, um, guaranteed screwed, um, if you don't let your elixir climb back up there. So, it's basically a time-killing deck. Um, you gotta take your time. Um, but if you have enough elixir, you don't have to. Um, we're gonna go ahead and just let it play through, honestly. Just let it play through with the, um, Night Witch and stuff. And then, uh, you know, the bat's gonna get destroyed. That's fine. Um, so, alright, thank you for giving us our... Um, main tower cannons. Thank you very much. King tower is just going to be good. The princess towers are there. Um, they're going to be good as well. So we're going to go ahead and put down this, this, um, and this right here. The rage and the graveyard will do a lot of damage to that. And I believe that's going to take that down. And we're going to be able to take this down too. So good game, dude. Good game, good game, all over the place, good game, okay, so we didn't get the job done, but we will be getting the job done, and, uh, yeah, so, my man right there, <laughs> clutching, clutching, making those clutch moves, uh, good game, um, so, yeah, that was actually an awesome game, I think, and, uh, we got the job done, and, uh, we got the crown chest as well, so we're gonna go ahead and do this, and then, uh, yeah, it ends in seven hours, and I believe I did that for half an hour, so, you know, um, we're gonna go ahead and uh, see what we get. We got a P.E.K.K.A., one P.E.K.K.A., um, uh, that's pretty okay. So, if you did enjoy this, uh, 2v2 practice challenge, I hope that you did enjoy, and I'll see you in the next video that I release of this, or anything that I release on the, my channel. Peace out, guys.